Hey everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be showing Casey a film that she should have seen a very long time ago in all honesty. I had to show her the first one when we first started dating, Back to the Future. She liked it, mm -hmm. but for whatever reason we never continued the trilogy. We're going to continue the trilogy today here. We're going to show her Back to the Future too. Yeah, like Anthony said, I saw the first one back when we started dating years ago and we just recently, last night actually, went back and watched the first one again just like as a little refresher. So it was super fun. And it was just as enjoyable on the rewatch and yeah I can't believe I never watched the next two I guess so I'm assuming this one because at the end of the last one Doc was like oh it's your kids like both of your kids you know in the future I'm assuming it's gonna have to do with their kids I do think that I know it's either in this one or this the next one I think it's in this one the shoes, the shoes I know yeah. the shoes I feel like I've seen the clip of the shoes a lot, but like the self lacing. You know the shoes? shoes. Yeah, I was but... gonna say shoes. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's because Nike came out with them yes, again. I was gonna like, say Reese a couple years ago. Well, they did. Okay, so they did an initial launch. I think maybe 10 years ago now, or maybe even less than that. Um, and that one had what they looked like, and then they actually made the ones that actually did yeah. self-lace after the fact. But the first batch, I don't think self-laced, and then the second batch, mm. they self-laced. Yeah, so I remember that coming out and like everybody was comparing them to the clip, but I had never watched the movie, so yeah. October 26th. <laughs> so it started back on the, when he saw the truck. Yeah. It's like, cause like, we literally just rewatched it last <laughs> night. So this is just like a straight continuation mm -hmm. for me. <laughs> what are you doing, is that a different girl? I think they did recast right? them, to be honest. I was like, literally was like, what? So did they refilm this whole scene then? Actually, I don't know, is it? I don't... Oh, no, 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 no. Me and you and Jennifer <laughs> both turned out fine. Your kids, Marty, something's gotta be done about your kids. <laughs> is it I, weird that I don't know, but I'm pretty I'm sure like I remember something? I'm like 90% sure that's a different girl. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to look that up, look that up after this. Because if so, they would have had to refilm it all. <laughs> Biff. <laughs> so that scene was definitely yeah. not shown at the end of the first mm -hmm. one. <laughs> the Biff scene. <laughs> Back to the Future 2. Honestly, this one was my personal favorite. I know the really? first one is kind of iconic, but... Mm. Anthony and I have been on like an 80s movie kick. Yeah, well, we got Casey started watching um, Naked Gun. Naked Gun. Then the... we watched Airplane. Yeah. This. Maybe we'll finish, more. We'll finish the trilogy. I'll um, watch the rest well, of the Naked Gun. Both trilogies, mm -hmm. I guess. Yeah, and then we'll see where else we'll go. Who knows? We're, we we want to watch mm -hmm. more 80s stuff, so comment down below if you have mm -hmm. suggestions. Any genre. Anything. I remember that was like wasn't that like back, call to, the it back to the future day? day yeah I'm pretty sure that's when the uh, the shoes came that's out. what it yeah. was yeah because I think that what day was it again October 21st so I had already graduated high school I had just graduated in that May <laughs> What does that mean? Why is it being like, well? You remember how he didn't want to like tell people like the oh, future and yeah. stuff? Yeah. <laughs> She's asking too many questions and no one should know too much about their future. <laughs> it's crazy how much inspiration Rick and Morty really took from this. <laughs> We'll never have flying cars. Because you can think about like getting a pilot license. And also, could you imagine drunk pilots? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like people would be crashing into freaking buildings. What? 
Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he kind of looked the same. Well, probably so he didn't have to have the prosthetics oh. on in this movie because you know he was mostly yeah. young in the last one. His run. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, it's him. What is he doing? <laughs> that was that that's the scene. I like how it's still kind of like an 80s aesthetic in the future though. <laughs> <laughs> what they thought the future yeah. looked like in the 80s. <laughs> like 80s but make it futuristic. <laughs> Perfect. You're the screen image of your future son. So that's a son. Oh! <laughs> dang, he looks just like him. Those jeans went hard. <laughs> Those jeans? Now your places were not done very well. <laughs> Go in and order a Pepsi. Here's a 50. Then wait for a guy named Griff. Right, Griff. 50 for a Pepsi. Probably because of inflation. <laughs> His arrest, Martin McFly Jr. Was tried, convicted, and sentenced to 15 years in the state penitentiary. <laughs> oh, Tried, dang. convicted, and sentenced? <laughs> that was efficient. <laughs> oh, whoa. Daughter, you see, this one event starts a chain reaction that completely destroys your entire family. Oh. Hey, Dr. Stig. Well, good looking out. I know. Look at, he's a real one. He came back to <laughs> prevent this. Wait a minute. Where are you going now? We just set the real Marty Jr. here taking his place around the corner at the Cafe 80s. Guy named Griff, just say no. Hey, what, what about Jennifer? We're not so, Griff. Oh, is it like Biff's son? Wait, what's his name? Biff? Yeah. Biff? Doesn't sound right. <laughs> that makes sense. It's gonna be played by him too, right? <laughs> so, flicks, flicks. They haven't fixed the clock tower yet. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. I love it. <laughs> oh my God. It's funny how like this one town has gone through so many time periods. <laughs> That looks like a Tesla. Yeah, that's something right. <laughs> what is that this time? <laughs> Jaws 19. <laughs> wow, Mo Max. The 3D. <laughs> <laughs> that 3D. <laughs> Uh, that reminds me of like the first 3D movie I ever saw. It was like the sp the SpongeBob movie thing. <laughs> I'm trying to like look at everything. Oh, <laughs> all the like vintage. Now it is vintage though. Sports almanac. Like all that looks like an antique store nowadays. But to them, when they first watched that, they were probably like, eh, all our stuff. The same diner. <laughs> the bomba fajita tortilla pita. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. They're, they're freaky looking. Mm -hmm. That's supposed to be Ronald Reagan. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've seen you around. You're Marty McFly's kid, aren't you? So this is Biff. Okay, I was like, is he Griff? Anybody home? What do you think? Griff just called me Grandpa for his help? He's Griff. Graham! <laughs> what the hell am I praying you for? Hey, kid. Say hello to your grandma. <laughs> still? still has the hots for still? Him? <laughs> Transcends time. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh iPad kids, but <laughs> more. <gasps> oh no, himself. I mean, his son. son. <laughs> that just so happens to look exactly like him. <laughs> Their two families have like an ongoing blood feud. <laughs> <laughs> decision about tonight's opportunity? Um, yeah, Griff, you know, I was thinking about it. I'm not sure because I just think... You know, it's like a, what's that, like Western, not Western, but it's like the McCoys and the Hatfields? Uh, no, something, like, something like that. Whoa! Scroll! Oh 
Oh. Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure that I should, you know, because I think that I should discuss it with my father. <laughs> You're your father! No gets her McFly! My gosh, his voice is like so bad! <laughs> Aww. Hey, Griff. I'll do it. I'll do it, buddy, whatever you say. Stay down and shut up. He takes after his grandfather. grandfather. Well, the original timeline yes, is grandfather. Yes, the OG timeline. <laughs> Grandfather C-97 or whatever, the Rick and Morty galaxy. <laughs> Let's hear the right answer. Wow! He's always here to clean everything up. When did you become the physical type? Stop it, his voice is mad. I can't handle it. <laughs> so, I'm assuming that meant no? <laughs> did we get mission accomplished? <laughs> oh, it's like the same thing again. I need to <laughs> <laughs> But <laughs> now it's a hoverboard this time? That's so funny. I like how they did like a lot of the same stuff. Yeah. It's like in the first one, he had the advantage. Yeah. <laughs> now he doesn't know shit about the future. <laughs> hey, but he has his little life hacks that he does. Very familiar about <laughs> What happens if you wet the hoverboard? Uh, -huh. uh oh. I mean, you're not that far oh. away. Can you just like? <laughs> I mean, just get off, grab the board, and just fucking okay, you're wet. <laughs> oh, his special hoverboard. Oh God! <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, he's gonna pull them. Yeah, he's got power. <laughs> drying mode. Ah. Wow! Mm -hmm. See, that's what we need. <laughs> okay. <laughs> With that robotic <laughs> ass voice. <laughs> Put some money on the cards. I my hand. Oh! <gasps> What did you just say? I said I wish I could go back to the beginning of the season. Put some money. Is he gonna go do that? Uh oh. Oh, does he remember? I haven't seen one of those in thirty years. Oh. Oh no. Because I used it on Jennifer, there wasn't enough power left, and I could shut out for a full hour. Damn. Oh no, freaking Biff. <sighs> All's well that ends well. So is that fine? No. <laughs> okay. This doesn't seem right. Something's wrong. It seemed a lot easier than the first yeah. film. <gasps> oh. Was committed. That means we take her home. Oh, it'll be dark by the time we get out. We're taking you home to your future home. We we'll arrive shortly. That means he's gonna see him, his future self, maybe. Or two, the encounter could create a time paradox, <gasps> which could cause a chain reaction that would unravel the very fabric of the space-time continuum and destroy the entire universe. Well, <laughs> let's hope for the first one. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Well, if Rick and Morty taught us anything, there's infinite universes that we could just take. <laughs> yeah. You got a little tranked, but I think you keep using that word tranked. Like, Is that like a drug that they keep using? Yes. Tranquilizer, right? I know, but like. Just take it easy. They say it so casually. Like, didn't like the son say that to like someone who was driving? Something what are you like on trank or some shit like that? <laughs> That's the drug of choice. Oh, no. Little did they know people would actually do horse tranquilizers <coughs> nowadays. <Channel>. Wow. The <laughs> TV's broken. It's a projector. <laughs> the future. Mm. Ooh. Was that your daughter or yourself? Mom. Mom, is that you? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's Michael J. Fox. 
Like you said, very strong genes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> um. Oh wow. Oh, out on the golf course. Uh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I need you all holler. Oh, come on, Doc. I want to check on my ass. We can't risk you running into your oldest self. Come on, honey. It's funny that, like, Doc actually breaks a lot of his own rules. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, the space time continuum. And then he's like, okay, we have to change your future. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he was the one in the taxi. The, did mm -hmm. you see what the top screen said? Uh. The inflatable tit? <laughs> oh, is that him? A <laughs> oh, self walking dog? <gasps> no, freaking Biff, he's gonna use the time machine, isn't he? Oh my gosh, he's gonna go back in time and bet on sports. <laughs> How does he even know how to use it? I mean, all oh. cars fly now, so... <laughs> Maybe he'll accidentally get to 88. <laughs> you just punch in, like, the little numbers. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, like, where you were, where you are, where you're going. <laughs> just shove it in my mouth. <laughs> what?! <laughs> it's gonna become a big pizza, isn't it? Hydrator. It's funny because even that appliance looks so old fashioned yeah. <laughs> compared to now. Mm -hmm. Stick your card in the slot and handle it. Ooh, don't do it. Oh, dang it. That's his weakness. <laughs> you can't handle being called chicken. <laughs> I feel like chicken's not even that bad. <laughs> oh, no. Out of all the insults. I know. Ito-san, konnichiwa. Makurai. I was monitoring that scan you just interfered. <gasps> oh. You are oh no! My no, please, no, I cannot be fired. You're I'm fired. fired. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, From the justice system to like terminations here in jobs, very efficient. <laughs> <laughs> I would say a joke, an office joke. Oh. Man. It's funny how they still would have fax in the future. When it's no, like no. not. I don't even know how to use a fax machine. <gasps> oh! That's. What are we having? Passing out? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that was the better scenario. So. <laughs> All right. No paradox. Better than I myself. Sorry. Yeah, great. It's three of you of us. Women. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you need a women machine. A oh, women machine? <laughs> I remember bars being on these windows. Oh, uh oh. Changes. The neighborhood. Oh, what the? Oh, That's like an entire dogs. pack of dogs. <laughs> All the houses are for sale. I would have sold. <laughs> <laughs> like, do you want to live there, to be honest? That means you just left Jennifer probably at like a random house <laughs> in the horrible neighborhood? Well, that was a different neighborhood, but still, they had bars on their window for a reason. You <laughs> before my life, you to me like a slacker. That's right. That's right, I am a slacker. Do you remember you gave me detention last week? Last week. The school burnt down six years. What the heck? So how far back did he go and what did he freaking do? Oh, look at the scar in his face, too. Oh my God, it's like living like a, in Mad a, Max. A war zone. <laughs> <gasps> oh! Oh! <laughs> what the heck? I mean, he's wearing a bulletproof vest for a reason. <laughs>
<laughs> like sell and get the hell out. I know. Hell Valley. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Oh, that was the guy from the first one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Drunk pedestrian. <laughs> Uh, oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, so he just got rich. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Biff, what does it say? Biff's Tau Paradise, Paradise or something like that, yeah. <laughs> oh! Like a fucking tank. Museum. Okay. Oh. Number one citizen and America's greatest living folk hero. What? And only Biff Humble Beginnings. And how a trip to the racetrack on his 21st birthday made him a millionaire over. Sick. <laughs> wow. Because he knew all of the winnings. Yeah. Oh. Well, she does not seem excited. Third <laughs> Oh my gosh! <laughs> so what does that mean? Marty never happened. Uh, I can call room service. <gasps> room service. <laughs> Wait, he's his father? How is that even possible? <laughs> she went back to drinking. Wow. Just when you had fixed her life. Oh. Oh, so. He's a stepfather. Idiot some Dave, I'll get his probation revoked. <laughs> and that's for Marty. Well, maybe you'd like to have all three of your kids behind bars, just like your brother Joe. <laughs> Aw, he went back to jail. <laughs> well, Joey, like nothing changed in his future. <laughs> Joey was always destined to go to jail. <laughs> Orange McFly. Marty, George, father. He died, he's didn't he? The place he's been for the past 12 years. So he did 12 years ago? Yeah, so he was obviously born and yeah. she got with George. Okay, but she remarried. March 15th, 1973. Yes, Marty, I know. Murdered. <gasps> he was shot. It was freaking Biff. <laughs> His house. <laughs> Awful, 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 awful mess. <laughs> oh, his bed. Oh. Obviously. I need didn't ask for any of this. Young Biff got his hands on that sports owner. I'll ask him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Clint Eastwood? Don't look. You haven't oh. seen this movie. <laughs> <laughs> ah, it's still going. Ow, that's making me dizzy. Okay, <laughs> keep it still. <laughs> it's still going. Don't look. I try not to. Casey hasn't seen the good, the bad, and the ugly. At this You're point, like not it doesn't covering matter. it, it doesn't at matter. all. I feel like a kid, like covering their, uh, I know. or not, uh, an apparent covering well, their I... kids' eyes from nudity. Guy is brilliant. And what the hell's going on? Party's over, Biff. And you're cheating on your wife. <laughs> Probably not the first time, to be honest. <laughs> Couldn't match up the bullet that killed your old man. <gasps> it was him, of course. I knew it. <laughs> Two McFlies with the same gun. <laughs> and that was the freaking gun. Was it the? Didn't he bring the hoverboard? Was it the hoverboard? I mean, that's a big hover. Okay, maybe not. How would we even get it there? Never mind. Wait, what is it? <laughs> oh, it's just a door. Is it the hoverboard? You thought too much. You overthought it. <laughs> that makes more sense. That makes logical sense. <laughs> Back to where it all started. I guess it started in 85, but still. <laughs> His whole big tower and his animal print aesthetic. Oh. Okay. Where did he leave Aini though? I guess at the house, oh, yeah. his house, because that's where they were when they were like talking about a. Uh, and Jennifer was just out. still on the bench. <laughs> yeah. 
It's so cool how it keeps like weaving back in and out of all the. Yeah. The, it didn't just the spend the entire line. time yeah. in like one era. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I keep forgetting. It's been like a, literally a single day. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Is it from every era? <laughs> it's funny because it's true. Like, what are the chances this exact day again? Oh my gosh, mm -hmm. Biff! <laughs> so unnecessary. He was always such a jerk. Four kids for three hundred dollar job. I can't even have lunch in the I shop. I could get a case of more out of you for three hundred bucks. It smells worse than that. You're wrong. Oh, ow! <laughs> ow! <laughs> Screen door in a submarine, you dork. Look, Biff. Somebody already asked me to the dance. Oh, that bug George McFly. I'm going with Calvin Klein. <laughs> Calvin <laughs> Klein. <laughs> Get the hell out of my car, old man. <laughs> marry that girl, Biff. I can help make it happen. So okay. That's what he the told him. Just get in the car, butthead. <laughs> or you call it butthead. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> <laughs> this book tells the future. It tells the results of every major sports event till the end of the century. Football, baseball, horse races, boxing. The information in here is worth millions. And until then, keep it on you, like this. Hey, what are you doing? Don't do oh you know my gosh. Oh, and there's one more thing. One day, a kid or a crazy wild... Oh. <laughs> it's funny because he didn't even seem like he was paying attention. Yeah, it's funny. How would you just... How would you talk to your younger self, you know? Yeah. Took him all that time. <laughs> oh, like when they were setting up the thing? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How did you know that? Oh, I Don't get too into it. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're literally doing the opposite of what <laughs> you said. Like I said, he contradicts himself a bit. There's no way you could spike the punch that much <laughs> with one bottle. This is like stressful. <laughs> this is stressful. He's gonna know. No, dang it! Anything at all. I'd like to have that in writing. Yeah, me too. <laughs> That's so funny how they did that, you know, like, like how just him sneak yeah. around the scenes of the first so movie. It's so funny. It's like a different perspective on everything that happened. Get it? It's so close. I'm getting stressed out. Man, I knew teachers like that in high school. <laughs> they just wanted ah! to <laughs> just wanted to get you for something. I got six referrals my senior year just for shaving offenses. <laughs> now kids could wear whatever the hell they want yeah. to school. They wear pajamas. Why do you even need this? What are you even looking at? You don't understand it. You don't know yet. Oh, okay. Well, that's easy. Yes. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> This is just the cover. He, oh my <laughs> gosh! What the heck? So he still has it! Dang it! Ooh la la! <laughs> Look! Uh -oh. Get him on stage! I don't know, but when he gets down, we're gonna know. <laughs> How the hell he changes clothes so fast? <laughs> yeah, it's an oldie where I come from. <laughs> Alright guys, now listen to the blues riff. But this is all new, so you have to stop them from stopping yeah. you. Yeah! They're just like waiting, like <laughs> politely waiting for him to finish. Hmm. 
<laughs> the three D glasses get me all the time. Like, who would think to just wear that out in yeah. public? <laughs> Look, I'm gonna see things in red and blue. <laughs> I think the last time I saw three D glasses was like in Spy Kids 3D. Like those types of three D glasses. Until they started doing like the I don't know, I don't even know what to call them, the darker frames. I yeah. feel like that started with mm -hmm. Avatar. They had three D in the fifties. <laughs> And this is when shit gets crazy with this solo. <laughs> eee, so close! <laughs> is he gonna fall? Oh, okay. Oh! <laughs> nice. They weren't ready. <laughs> He was right there, like right behind him the whole time. Oh yeah, this part. <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh. What's the matter? Where you going? Oh no. Are you chicken? <gasps> <gasps> Dang it! Oh, he's the freaking chicken. It's his trigger word. Let it go. Let it go, Marty. As Elsa would say. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let it get to you. No. All of that, just for him to take it back. Ugh. He's still, He's like, still just careless so with it, yeah. <laughs> that would have been like, my precious. <laughs> like, Where is he fuck going? the oh, dance, the fuck everything else. I would have just been like holding and clutching that with <laughs> my like cold, dead fingers. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah, finally, finally. <laughs> it's a long way. I mean, you have your hoverboard, right? Does it go yeah, fast? Yeah, but I don't oh, think. Oh, not fast enough? Yeah, not as fast as a car. Didn't they not go as fast back then? I know, but still. <laughs> like, he doesn't have any power. Remember? Oh, yeah. I forgot. <laughs> 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 oh! It's the DeLorean! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, he's gonna hit something. Is it manure again? <laughs> Just how it was. All has been reset. <laughs> Remember, like, the picture from the first one? Oh, it changed. stuck he well he'll come back right he's got to come back for you oh my gosh what the heck doc doc come in doc i don't think your radios will work over time <laughs> <laughs> he's got he's gonna come back and be like marty something <laughs> oh no Oh no. Who the hell are you? Western Union. <laughs> oh. Actually, a bunch of us at the office were kind of hoping maybe you could shed some light on the subject. So we've had that envelope in our possession for the past 70 years. 70 years. Did he go back to the Wild West? Like he said, because Western Union? <laughs> oh my gosh. 
before you struck my leg. <sighs> First, let me assure you that I'm alive and well. I've okay. I've been happily these past eight months in the year 1885. <gasps> he went to the Wild West! 1885! <laughs> September 1885! Wait, are we gonna get to see it, though? Because that would be so cool. But how can you don't have a time machine? There's only one man who can help me. The oh my gosh, what the heck? <laughs> Dang. That's what I loved about this movie, how they yeah. kind of like wrote a story around the first uh -huh. one. Mm -hmm. Then he's gonna run up on him being like, I need your help again. <laughs> After you just like completed your mission. <laughs> hey, but there's not two in the timeline anymore. Well, in this time period. <laughs> oh my gosh. And here he is again. <laughs> Different timeline, Morty. Marty. 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 <laughs> Marty. <laughs> we watch way too much Rick and Morty. <laughs> oh my gosh. The next one, if they don't go to the Wild West, I'm going to be so disappointed. <laughs> This is a part <gasps> <Yay>! of the movie. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm just gonna stop it and not watch all of it. Because I feel like even though this was shown to everybody else, it's still spoilers. Mm -hmm. Especially because we're just gonna watch the movie soon. Exactly. So I think people had to wait um, less than a year. Mm. Um, I don't think it was like um, an Infinity War Endgame situation. I feel like the best way I could describe it was... Um, which, you know, this is another franchise that Casey never finished. She watched the first Matrix movie, mm. and then they made the next two Matrix films, uh, Matrix Reloaded and Matrix Revolutions? Rev the Revolutions, if I'm not mistaken. Those two were filmed back-to-back -back mm. and released six months apart. This was predated when I saw it. I saw it as a kid in the 90s, but... I'm pretty sure that was the same situation here. So I didn't let Casey watch the entirety of that end scene right there, but she does know that we go to the Wild West. Um, so what'd you think of the film? It was good. I liked how they went at back to the first one, but mm -hmm. like in the future too, it, it all interconnected. And I always love those kinds of movies where they like see themselves doing what they were doing beforehand. And like, yeah. it just makes the original movie i mean obviously that mission was like such a big deal but now it just makes it even grander because now like there was a second mission going on and now there's gonna be like a third mission so it's, it's pretty cool how it yeah. all like interconnects and intertwines i also liked kind of the character consistency too like biff was still the bad guy and yeah. then his grandson even back in the future back in the future <laughs> um and just how even uh marty's son became kind of like his father what was originally i really love these movies so far and i just yeah, I, I don't know why I never saw this. I don't know why I never went on to watch the next two after watching the first one, because they're so fun, and there's a reason that these these movies are so loved by so many people. Yeah, I think, if I'm not mistaken, that this one actually was the least favorite out of a lot of people's really? minds, but for me, it was one of my favorites. I liked seeing them go back into the future, kind of like what you said earlier in the film, like what the people in the 80s would have perceived the future to yeah. be like. It's kind of like an enhanced version of the 80s is kind of the best way I could describe it. And what you also said, it was them hopping around the timelines. You know, we we're in the 2015s, <laughs> the mm -hmm. tw 2015, yeah. and then we went to 85, and then we went back to 1955, and then how it all kind of centered around that same incident, which was in 1955, and then kind of him running up on Doc there at the end. Yeah. Uh, it was really, really funny. And then you saying Morty, like it was I really know. Like it's a different timeline Morty. That's like something straight out of Rick and Morty, which now I can definitely see how Rick and Morty took so much inspiration from yeah. this. Like the way they talk, just the way that the story even is set up. And another thing that was super cool was that like that it was very linear. Well, not really. <laughs> 
But like, it's like things were just happening right after like yeah. Marty left, and then all of a sudden he was back. Like it, they didn't miss any time. There was yeah. no time gaps. Like this all happened within the same span of like the couple of days or whatever. Mm. Um, so it's pretty cool. Well, at the end of the first, he got back to the yeah, 80s, the same and then day. next second later, okay, we got to go to 2015, <laughs> yeah. and then we get back to the the 80s, and then we have to go to the 50s. Yeah. I'm also curious to see what the next movie is going to be about because they're going back to the 1800s. Like, why did he have to stay so long? Did he run out of his plutonium or whatever? Like, why didn't he just come back immediately, you know? He had to send a, yeah. a Western Union through the 70 years <laughs> to get delivered. Which, years. somehow, it miraculously didn't get lost and got delivered, so... Hey, Western Union is very reliable. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I love this film. Uh, it's It brought back a lot of nostalgia, what Casey was talking about with Rick and Morty. I haven't seen these films since we first saw Rick and Morty, which we saw that on the channel for the very first time. Talk about what you talked about, the parallels between uh, Rick and Morty as opposed to Doc and Marty. They're very obvious, and you yeah. can definitely tell they got massive inspiration mm -hmm. from these films. And I kept thinking that same thing throughout the film, like Morty as opposed to every time yeah. that he said Marty, but then you actually said it. I thought I was going to be the one who slipped up and called him Morty, but it was you. <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.